I'm gonna show you how to set up the Google Pixel 9 Pro or the Google Pixel 9 Pro XL. Okay, so first thing is go ahead and turn it on. You got the power button here, just press and hold till the Google logo pops on. Wait for it to boot up until you're here, to the welcome screen here. First thing is go ahead and choose your language. Just tap down here and choose your language. I'm good with English in the United States and I wanna tap on get started down here. Set up using another device to copy settings, accounts, and more from another phone or tablet, iPhone, or iPad. Just keep it nearby unlocked, okay? If you wanna go that way, just make sure you have the device near here. For myself, I'm gonna do a clean, fresh install. I'm just gonna go ahead and skip this. Connect to a Wi-Fi network. You can connect to it now if you have Wi-Fi or you can skip and always do it later, but I'm gonna do it now, try to get that latest update. My Wi-Fi here is not showing. Let me tap on see all Wi-Fi networks. And yep, mine's right here. Go ahead and input your Wi-Fi password. After you put the password in, tap on connect. It says obtaining IP address. Okay, now it says getting your phone ready. This may take a few minutes. It's asking you to sign into your Google account, basically your Gmail, so you can go ahead and sign in now or you can skip and do it later if you wish. For myself, I'm just going to go ahead and skip this. I don't remember my password right now, so I'm gonna skip. Connect to a mobile network, okay? So right now, you can go ahead and set up your eSIM, or you can go ahead and insert, insert a physical SIM card, okay? Or you can do it after all the setup's complete. For myself, I'm gonna do everything after this setup is all complete. So I'm just gonna skip this part for now, skip. Create a six digit pin password. You can skip, but I would advise just go ahead and do that now. Let me just make a quick six digit pin here. And then re enter again. Tap on confirm. Set up fingerprint unlock. Basically, fingerprint unlock. Okay, you can go and skip that, or you can do it now, or you can never do it if you wish. Okay, for myself, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, set this up right now. So let's go ahead and scroll down. Go all the way down to this changes to I agree down here. Then we're gonna go ahead and tap on that right there. And now we're gonna go ahead and start it. And I'm just gonna use my right thumb here. So I'm just gonna press it on there. Vibrate up, vibrate up. Oops. So what you wanna do is get this blue circle all the way around. So just keep going. Vibrate, vibrate, vibrate. Just keep going all around your finger. And we're just about done. Okay, fingerprint added. Now you can add another fingerprint right now if you want, or you can always add another fingerprint later on if you wish as well, okay? But I'm fine with my thumb for now. I'm gonna tap on next. Set up face unlock. This is basically a face ID password. You can set this one up as well. You can do it now or you can do it later. For myself, I'm just gonna do it another time, so I'm gonna go no thanks with this one. Google services, go ahead and read through these. Use location, allow scanning, send diagnostic data. These are all optional, okay, so that's up to you. For myself, I'll go ahead and keep them all toggled on and just make sure you go all the way down and then you can see accept down here. Tap on accept. Limit, limited warranty information, you can read through that and then tap on next. Additional legal terms, go ahead and read through that and then if you accept, tap on I accept. Get peace of mind, go ahead and read through these. Go ahead and read through all that, Go scroll all the way down and then you'll get the option to go next. Review additional apps so you can pick and choose what you want and don't want. And even if you uncheck and then you want it later, you can always get it later on, okay? But for mine, I'm all fine with all these checked. I will tap on okay for myself. And here's just some gestures. You can try it or you can skip it. We'll just go ahead and try it really quick. So to go home, swipe from the bottom up on the screen. Put your finger here, swipe straight up. Next one, to go back, you can swipe left or right here, just like that, to go back. Switch apps or basically see your recent apps that are open, just go down here and just let go. Looks like we're done. Let's go ahead and tap on done right there. You're all set, and voila, we are in business. Now the next video, I'm gonna go ahead and insert a physical SIM card. If you wanna see that video, look in the description below.